right, guys, don't forget to click the virtual 3D tour. What's nice about the virtual 3D tour, you'll be able to go ahead and walk through this property and see everything in detail. This is how we are doing the new technology today, folks. You don't even need to be here. That's right. All you need to do is click in the link in the description below, which will take you to the 3D tour. All right, what's up, everybody? If you are just tuning into the channel for the first time, I'm Chuck. It's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas, your Las Vegas realtor. So today, the video we're gonna do something a little bit different. Um, here's a new listing that's coming up on the market, but I really need your guys' help. I want to know exactly what you think this property is worth and what we should list this property at. So let's take a look at this thing. So today we are here in the city of Henderson. Inspirata, that's right, Inspirata, we're in phase one. Uh, this home right here was built in 2018. Property has three bedrooms, loft, office, and also a game room, three and a half bathrooms total. This was built by Pulte, and this is a beautiful exterior. I know that you guys love that uh, modern type of home, so we're going to look at this property in fine detail. We're going to take a look at all the upgrades and the options, but I want you to comment below. If you were me, right, you were a listing agent, what would you list this property? Okay, I can tell you right now with this elevation has been fully upgraded to the highest level. The garage has been upgraded to as well. Very beautiful home. All right, so let's take a look at this. Love the uh, the veneers. Love the uh, color block here. Here's the uh, side entry to the backyard. However, this home is uh, facing south. As you can see, the sun is setting on that side here. We do have some nice pavers. Love the fact that you got this front balcony here. Look at that. It's eight foot frosted glass on the garage door. This is a three car garage, obviously. So let's head inside. Love that uh, door here, that frosted glass. All right. Whew. It is getting a little bit hot inside, outside actually. Now, let's take a look at this thing. Boy, take a look at this island. So we got the Petrofina two inch with the waterfall island. Now with this waterfall island, as you can see, the quality of it's really nice. You got the undermounted sink, the Blanca sink. Again, we know this runs from 850 all the way to $1,000. Take a look at this. We got two dishwashers. Really nice for entertainment. Hey, isn't that gorgeous? I gotta like pan around real quick. Look at this, the refrigerator. Refrigerator right here is a 48 inch built in refrigerator. The built out alone on this, $8,000 for this refrigerator. The, uh, the cabinets are a level four cabinets. And just with the cabinets alone, you're paying a total of about almost $10,000 on the cabinets. Just take a look here. You got some pull out drawers. They ran about $3,000 on the pullouts. Again, with the dovetails. Let's take a look. Soft closing cabinets. MC, we talked about this. Favorite cabinet maker right here, boom. You can just tell from the quality, look at this. Soft closing cabinets, you got the cook countertops. You got the nice backsplash. Look at that cabinet, 48 inch cabinets here. And you got the upper cabinets, which is really nice. So they did a lot of upgrades. Did I say 48? Actually 42s, I'm sorry. Look at this home, gorgeous, right? So these are actually the European
appliance is. I'm going to show it to you guys again. It's the monogram. I don't know if this video does its justice, but you got this fireplace here. Just the fireplace alone was about $12,000 for this built-in fireplace. Now this right here is actually the, uh, the game room. Now the game room with the sliding glass doors, you got a 15 foot slide, right? You got another 15 foot slide. With all these slides total, over $25,000 just for this. Because remember, you're paying for the structure. Now you got this glass slide here. This is the aftermarket, okay? This came in around about $8,000 or $10,000, I think it was, on this glass slide. Isn't this really nice? It did a really good job, though. Look at that. Oh, yeah. So the owner of this home, prospect this home out really well. I mean, look at this. You got six can lights on this one. You got 18 by 18 porcelain tile. So this was actually a standard with the builder. However, you can upgrade this throughout the whole house, and that's what happened here. You got seven inch baseboards with a skip trawl. You got a 5.0 surround sounds, and you got the built in speaker. I believe that alone was already like $3,000. The whole package was a total of about $6,000. You got ceiling fans throughout, which is really nice. You got 10 foot ceilings. Okay. What I like about this is the, uh, the massive bedroom is downstairs. So that's what makes this really nice. All right, so let's take a look here. So as we enter, we have some cabinets. Okay, nice. <laughs> now I believe this room is uh, 18 by 18. You do have crown throughout the whole house. You got your Cat 6 and also your cable as well. Your thermostat sitting right there. Six panel door. You got your USB ports on each side. So your bed is going to come here. Take a look at that. You got the nice window. Take a look at this view right here. Isn't that gorgeous, the mountain view? That's hot, isn't it? You got the orange peel texture, that was about $3,500. Coming into the bathroom, you have a nice vanity. You got your framed in mirror. That was about another $3,000. Look at your pre-wire for your lights, that is a upgrade. Then you have your tub. This property has a total of about almost 131,000 in upgrades just for the interior alone. Now the owner of this property definitely takes pride in what he owns. I mean, this is a resale home, but I mean, clearly the attention to detail. Here's the uh, closet. Closet just all standard. And here's the uh, the commode or the half bath. Well, not half bath. Why am I saying half bath? I'm such a dummy sometimes. Lose my train of thought. Water closet. And the six panel door. Should we go outside or wait till last? Let's wait till last for the outside. And this is interesting right here. This we have a pocket door which is real nice. You have a two, two inch casing on the door. You got a convection a microwave and also your microwave, I'm sorry, your oven. Yeah, I'm really screwing up, man. I'm screwing up. Maybe I'm just trying too hard, that's what it is. So all this is an upgrade right here, but take a look at this. Extra pantry, this is what I love, the extra pantry, look at this. Five shelves. You also got the two-tone paint with the uh, eggshell. I think with the paint alone was about $3,500 on this spec. So it comes all the way around. Right here is the three-car garage, but let's go back this way. Boom, boom, boom. 
Look at this. You got the nice tray ceiling, one foot. All right, let's go inside the uh, garage. So as you can see, we have a three car garage. The interior has been, well, the interior of the garage has been textured, which is really nice. And the garage panels here are about almost $12,000 just for that option loan. You do have the uh, tankless water heater. And this tankless water heater was a total of, I think about, what was it, like $4,000 on this thing? And you got the soft water. This would run you about another 4,500. And take a look at this. He also aftermarket through a humidifier, which is really nice. Garage are nice and high. I believe this is a total of what, almost 13, no, not 13 feet, uh, 11 feet, I'm sorry. Yeah, that is really nice. Look at that. Love the fact that it really brings in a lot of light. All right, let's go inside. Oh, it'd be nice to put a nice water feature right here. That'd be kind of cool, All right? Let me know in the comments below. We got some extra storage space. And I believe for this um, AV closet alone, this ran about, I think, $3,800 for that. Here's your office. This office is about 13 by 13. As you can see, we got a pre-wire for the ceiling fan, which is really nice. And every room has your one-in-one, -one, your um, Cat 6, and also your cable, which is really nice. We got carpet nice and plush. Let me come over here. We have powder. and your 36 inch vanity. Now all the um, hardware and fixtures in the bathroom is a total of about $4,000. Here's your junior suite. This room is about 13 by 12 I believe or a little bit bigger than that. Again we have all four can lighting. Right here, this would be your TV setup. This would be great for guests right here. All tile work. This was all a upgrade at the time. Cool, nice. All right, let's go this way here. Take a look at the closet. So we got a walk-in, oops. Decent size. And take a look at this, a laundry room. So the laundry room, just to, uh, for the sink alone, that was $1,500 to do that laundry room right here. And you have washer and dryer. This is a LE. So we got some storage space underneath the staircase here. Now, as you all know, I always be keeping it real, okay? You know, I'm not gonna uh, gas you guys up as far as, um, oh yeah, this is the best property, okay? And you know how I like to do it, like I like to keep it real, so I'm gonna keep it real with you guys, because that's what I do. And the owner knows that I'm gonna do it, so it is what it is, okay? That's just who I am. So, I mean, you got little holes here, but it, to me it's not a big deal, right? Like I notice here, 
you take this off, but I mean, you could just fill that up. It's not a big deal, right? Uh, one thing that I would probably do is the grout. I would probably clean up the grout because I noticed um, like certain spots, it is a little bit dirty as far as high traffic, but that could be cleaned very easy. The custom uh, rails here, this was a structural upgrade at the time, and also the um, design feature of this as well was an upgrade. So again, you would have to do the structural, then you would have to pick your railings. So we've got a 48 inch uh, staircase. Uh, on this one, looks like we have a Mohawk, I believe, on the, uh, the carpets. Now coming upstairs, this is kind of cool though, because this, you could have added another bedroom up here. But what they decided to do is make one large loft. So this is great for entertainment or entertain your guests. So all your TV would go here. You can play pool, you know, foosball, whatever you want. The good news is that you can also put a guest up here too as well. And I believe this room, this one is 13 by 13. So it is a pretty large room. It is another suite. Now, you do have some slight marks here which could be painted not a big deal okay now if you guys can guess exactly what I'm going to list this property in the comments below I'm gonna send you guys some free merch that's right okay Now, I noticed you got this right here. Uh, this tends to happen. I don't know if you guys can see this or not, but we're going to have to get that cocked. And that's not a big deal. Easy fix. Easy fix. All right. Let's take a look at this. We got the balcony. Got an unlocked door. And as you know, I always have trouble opening doors for some reason. Look at this. Isn't this nice? Look at this. Deck's nice and clean. Home is like unbelievably well maintained. Now let's go downstairs and let's really take a look at this. So I don't know if I mentioned um, just the interior alone was 130,000 in upgrades. Oh, I forgot to mention 15 foot slide, aluminum, dual pane windows. And take a look at this. This has gotta be breathtaking right here. Now, this client is a YouTube follower and um, he had purchased a beautiful property. This dude is young, handsome, and single ladies, all right? So, just want to let you know, if y'all want to mingle, just let me know. I will become the procuring cause of this transaction. And I'm going to send out the referral fees, ladies. But I mean, take a look at this. You got the fireplace, you got the jacuzzi, you got the LED lights in the jacuzzi, turns color. Check this out, the waterfall. We got to turn on the waterfall. Okay. All right, give me a second here. Give me just a second. I get the waterfall on. Oh, here we go. Water feature. There it is. Also, whoa. What's up with the gimbal? Whoa. Folks, Gimbo just died on me, man. I don't know what's going on. Take a look at this. You got the Ferraris of pool pumps. Just this piece alone right here, $2,500. What this does is it sends chemicals directly into the pool, right? So that way you don't even need a pool guy. Isn't that cool? Back here, we got a doggy run, two AC units. You got nice river rock here. Just the backyard alone, $100,000. Just the backyard. 
I mean, take a look at that. Isn't this not gorgeous or what? All right. Look at that. So basically the pool just steps down. I mean, look, look at the deck, the cooling deck. I mean, this is how clean this dude is. <laughs> it's like he's never lived there. I guess that's what happens when you're a bachelor. I'm serious, girls. I'm, you all better send me a referral fee. I'm going to hook you guys up. Look at this. You got all the lights. Look at this. Isn't that cool? Walk back over here. It's going to look nice when the lights kick on. Okay. Here's that front gate again. This one you got wood eaves. You know, I was talking about that. I prefer the uh, the stucco. Man, all this river rock, man, this is expensive. But, I mean, take a look at this view. It's a gorgeous view. You got mountains on both sides. I'm going to come back around this way. Show you all what's up. Look at this. Isn't that like gorgeous right there? Now, let's get another angle of this. This right here, this glass right here is, oh, this is awesome. Love that glass. But I'm gonna get another angle so that way y'all can see what is going on here, okay? And the slides are really well. Nice and heavy aluminum slide, so I definitely do love that. Definitely quality. But the reason why I want to get this open because I want to show you exactly what this thing looks like, like open, right? Because the, the sun is starting to go down. But I mean, take a look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? See, that's, that's what I'm talking about. This is definitely the quality of life that we all should be living. Look at that. Well, guys, let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are about this property. Number one, can you see yourself living in this property? Number two, I'm about to list this property on the market. I'm curious to hear what you would actually pay for it. And number three, if the person comes the closest to what I'm gonna list this property at, I'm gonna send you some free merch, that's right. If you haven't had a chance to tune into this channel, I'm sorry, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, man, it's getting late. It's almost 8 o'clock. Anyway, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, I don't know what you guys are doing, guys. Maybe now is the time to subscribe. Other than that, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Chuck, it's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas, and have a blessed day.